This is the week you do not want to be without working air conditioning. It's a problem for dozens of people at an apartment complex in Lexington. Last month, a storm caused a power surge, knocking out 56 AC units at the Arbor at Cotton Grove. Between supply chain issues and inflation, the problem still isn't completely fixed. WFMY News 2's Amber Lake found out how management and a local church stepping in to help. It was very, very hot. No air conditioning. I almost thought that my body was going to melt. Inside 56 homes. And my bones was going to melt and my muscles. In my apartment, being on the second floor, um, you know, with heat rising, and everything like that, it was really, really hot. A storm knocked out the AC units at the Arbor at Cotton Grove Complex in Lexington. It was warm. Saranda Sturdivant has five children. She says the heat was too much until the complex provided some temporary relief. They immediately provided um, fans for us. Well, for me, um, I was grateful for that. But other than that, yeah, it did get a little hectic, but um, you know, I took my kids to the splash pad. The complex told us they started knocking on doors as soon as the units died. They checked on residents and provided box fans if needed. The maintenance man even put window units in homes that needed it the most. I just appreciate that they took action so fast and that it was taken care of. One resident has lupus. She says the heat makes her symptoms much worse. Because of lupus, a lot of people don't know you know, the conditions you have in the heat and how you have flare ups, but they this is the first time I've lived somewhere that they've taken care of it and actively checked. First Baptist Church in Lexington also stepped up to help. Everybody seemed to be very happy. They delivered 100 fans last week, as well as ice towels. That a little boy came up to us and said, Mom, Mommy said that I needed to come out and thank you, and he handed us a, a handwritten note. Um, so that was really special and that was really important. Now 36 of the 56 units have been repaired. For the 20 still without a fix, the complex's maintenance man has installed window units so people there have some sort of relief.